I don't think I got the trophy here. Was there supposed to be a trophy here, Tony? I don't know if you played the PS3 version, but I think there's a there is a secret trophy. Hold on, let me check something. I think I'm back. No, I don't think I got a tr Now for puzzles, okay. I, I didn't get a trophy. I guess I can't go that way. And here's the puzzle. You're playing on the PS3 on the other side. Cool. My best game after RDR, okay. Okay, there's no sphere there I can use. I can't use that sphere just yet. Is there another sphere over here, maybe? Is there a sphere up here? No. something. Okay, I admit, I kind of looked up a walkthrough for this one. Not 100%, but... Nothing there. Alright, I see the destruction sphere. Set itself. Oh, that's BS. Uh, if you leave the room, it resets itself.
That's irritating. Yeah. Activates that. Where was that glyph sphere? There it is. I try to be on it at all. I try to be on as much as possible, Tony. Thank you for saying that it's great watching me. If you miss any of my videos, you're welcome to check out my archive on YouTube at youtube.com slash maniac536. Um, I, I usually keep the archive there. Also, I have videos on it, um, not YouTube.com, but um, I, I also have, obviously, there's this, my Twitch channel. I'm also, uh, I just also opened up a Beam channel at beam.pro slash maniac536. Okay. That was not what I was expecting to happen. <laughs> I was trying to teleport it, but I can't. I don't see the teleport. If I do this... No, I need some rocks. I need some rocks here. Because I need to slide that back up, don't I?
leave it at the original place. Hold on. What if I put this here? Alright, I think I know what you're saying. Leave it at the original place, don't move it, I see. And then go up and teleport it. Okay, we'll try that. Alright, we'll put it here. I should reset it there at the podium. But I can't... That glyph is covered. Let's try this one more time. I'll put it back in position and see what happens. I need to do the puzzle first, okay. Oh, so I have to complete the puzzle. Where's the third column? Maybe this is it? Get all the poles up, okay. I think I know what you're saying. Okay, all the poles should be up now. There we did it. Yeah, yeah, I see what you're saying. That did it. That did it. gonna put that right there for a second or two. I gotta get this back up. Okay. you demand. And the chest should be here. Alright, that's the chest. Let's see what's in it. Anything good? A lock sphere. Okay, that's something good. Alright, let's finish this. I'm not just a pretty face. <laughs> well, thank you! <laughs> Let's reset this and let's get going. But first, I have to move a few things around really quick. Okay. 
Alright, there's that. Let's move you. Don't need that right here, right now. Put this here. down there. Okay, that should restore that column on that end. Okay, so that's one column. There's a white there's a white dot here, so that tells me that the second column is probably active. So all I need to do is activate the third column, which should be somewhere over here. I'll use this orb here to activate the third column. I've already got the destruction sphere, so there's no reason keeping it. I already got what it what it already earned, so that should be everything. Unless I forgot something, I'm pretty certain everything is back. And now I just screwed it up again. Ah. Uh. I was so close. I was so close, and I stepped on that panel and reset the damn thing. Ugh. That was frustrating. I didn't mean to step on that panel. The movement is just so imprecise in this game. I am so sorry, Tony. Now, actually, I was always really good at solving puzzles. When I was a kid, I was really good at solving puzzles. Uh, people, they did some tests on me and they determined that unlike some people that could usually have great activity more to the creative portion or the analytical portion, the left hemisphere, the right hemisphere, um, my brain was pretty much an equal 50-50, which meant that while I wasn't as creative or as smart as people that would be left brain dominant or right brain dominant, I would be able to function well in both creative as well as analytical positions. It's just how my brain works. Um, yes, I admit that is probably something that, you know, that I was probably born with, but, you know, when I was in college, I was studying for disciplines that, you know, were like, those go together? You can do both of those? Really? I had no idea that you could actually do, you know, I, I had professors that would have classes that would be like, you're taking that? <laughs> I can't even do that. <laughs> Um, uh, well, we could if you could tell me two things. One, where all the Jack spear spheres were, because I only found one of them, so... If you could tell me where the other Jack, the other Jack spheres were, that would be very useful. We are, we are trying to get all the Albed sigils, though. Alright, let's try better this time. To not step on the reset button. I think we're doing it. I think we're doing it. Don't touch that, you fool. That's the history eraser button. Please. Give us a chance to explain. No need. I already know what I'll tell the other maesters. Meaning? Lord Seymour was the leader of the Guado before becoming a maester. You're not letting us go. Let you go? Lord Seymour would never forgive us if we did. Wait! Wait! Jiskel's sphere! We can show it to them! You mean this? Hey! 
the Guado take care of Guado affairs. Oh, wait. Run! Okay, I guess we're running. But I am saving right now. But I can't play Blitzball. Is that a bug or is that just I can't play right now? Run. Okay, I'll run. Oh, come on! potions on these guys, I swear to God. Yeah, how bad guy's going. Wow, I'm finally prepared now. I actually feel prepared for the battle that I'm on. <laughs> Nice. I'm switching out for Walker. He did not like that. Yeah, this is what my house is going to look like tomorrow. I'm fairly certain that this background that you're seeing is what my house is going to look like. I'll take it. I still can't play Blitzball. Alright, just let me save really quick. Nice. 
think we made it. Ah, oh, sweet, they caught on a Rapa? Oh boy. is strong. Hey, right, let's see how good our cure spell is. That's not too bad. Guys, they just auto potion themselves, though. the big boy, okay. I can do that with Waka. That should blind him. Oh, and of course he gave my drops. Alright. Who's up? Waka. White magic cast Cura on herself. That's pretty powerful. Black magic. Thunder on that. That hurt much. Haste and protect is the key to beating anything.
White magic. Use the cure spell on Oron. Um, about a year. Like, I, I pretty much... That's a good question, Angel. Oh, well, welcome, Angel Rolls. I didn't see you came back. Um, I have been streaming for about a year. Um, most of what made me want to do streaming regularly is the fact that I got subscribers. Uh, I guess uh, as I... Uh, Play around with him and blind him all the time. Okay, okay, that's a good one. Okay, I'll do that. Hey, Kajar! <laughs> Boy, you missed the disappointing. <laughs> you missed the disapp- You too, you Angel Rose and you Tony and you Kajar, you guys missed the disappointing first hour of this stream. <laughs> In comparison to that, that, that first hour, I don't think I'd be able to get through. <laughs> I don't think I would have been able to get through it with that, uh, uh, special. No, I want the skill. You're saying blind it, I can blind it. Oh, I'm good. We're, we're, we've After that fight with Seymour and getting through the Ma uh, Makalania Temple, uh, we've been doing much better now. Oh, trust me, you didn't miss much. <laughs> you did not miss much at all. You fell asleep with you. Oh, I'm sorry, to, uh, Kajar. <laughs> yes, I do. It's uh, at Maniac536. I also have a website, GameExcess.net. G-A-M-E-X-C-E-S-S.net. That is my website. My Twitter, at Maniac536. And if you want to miss any parts of my uh, YouTube uh, stream of this game or of any other games I've streamed, I have uh, I have a stream up at uh, I have my YouTube channel has all of my videos archived at uh, YouTube.com/maniac536, and also on Game Access I have them uh, mirrored there as well or embedded there too. So if you just want to do a straight uh, a, a just straight check, you can of my streams you can just go on my Let's Play uh, tab or you can just go on my YouTube channel. I have all of, um, I have all of my, uh, all right. Get mad, I can mess things up. <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. Does this thing ever die? <laughs>
Yay, we finally killed it. You're hosting me. Just follow on Twitter as well. Yes. Oh, God, yes. Against Seymour. Oh, my God. He fought like such... I would say camper. He fought like a camper. He was so cheap. Thankfully, Tony was the man, and he told me, Oh, all you gotta do is uh, use null attacks. Like, like do null... Have the white mage cast null, uh, uh, null, null abilities. Yeah. Yeah, it was Seymour. It was... It took me an hour. Five attempts on Seymour. Five. Five attempts on Seymour. Five. And I got him down to the, to the final... I, I beat his Aeon, and I still... Five attempts on Seymour. Five. Praise be to Yevon. That's what I would have said if I was a follower of Yevon. We were all there and in one piece, even if I had a headache from wondering what was in store for us next. Okay, this is not where I thought it was. I have no idea where we are right now. I still can't play Blitzball. Is that a bug or is that intentional? We're under the lake ice, aren't we? Look, that's the bottom of the temple. We've fallen have to climb a back up. Way. Try to always have the Aeons with full overdrive. I can use them for bosses. What now, I wonder? What now? Uh, you act first and think later, don't you? I mean, can't you be a little more responsible? We're all depending on you, you know? A lecture. No, no, no. <laughs> Just a suggestion. You should place trust in your friends. But you can't expect someone to protect you all the time. Okay, and certain it's intentional because you you're a traitor to Yevon. Oh that. boy. Okay. Is that a lecture? It's advice. I guess I guess I'm a pariah right now, religiously, in this game, which is understandable. <sighs> Hey, Waka, would you cheer up? I, look, we only you can play it again after Ravel. Okay. It doesn't matter. Don't you see? I've always walked the path of Yevon. But now, I'm a traitor. <laughs> only use them when you're How mad. How could this happen? Damn. It's not Riku's fault either. <sighs> you don't know how I feel. I'm sure Yuni's okay. She's breathing fine and all. How are Lulu and Waka? Hmm. Well, Waka's in shock. Can't blame him either. And Lulu? Well, she's just the same as always. She's so together. All grown up, I guess. I guess. Well, just give me five or six more years. Okay! So, Kamari, how do we get out of here? Hey, don't change the subject. We climb. Kimari too. Only those who try will become. Huh? I think he means you have to work hard if you want to be like Lulu. Oh, I will. Kimari think Riku should stay Riku. Huh? Hey, are you saying I'll never be like Lulu? Kimari! <laughs> How could you That's laugh at a saying. time like this? 
¿Y una? He's saying you're not. Luke, I wanted to follow your own path. Is what he's saying. His father, Lord Jiskel. I wanted to convince him to turn himself in to Yevon's judgment. In exchange for marriage. Yes, if that's what it took. So, what did Seymour say? He didn't say anything. Now, I. Now I don't even think it was worth it. I should have told you what I was going to do. Enough. Dwelling in the past is futile. Hey, you don't have to say it like that. You want to waste time listening to her regrets? You don't have to say it like that. Our immediate concern is Yuna's pilgrimage. Are you willing to go on? Yes. But then, do you think Yevon will allow it? The Faith are the ones that give power to the Summoners. Not the Temples or the Teachings. If the Temples try to stop us, then we will defy Yevon if we must. Whoa! I can't believe you said that! Sir Oren? Count me oh. out! Well, enjoy your tea time. We have to atone to make up for the sins we have committed. Of course. I need. I want tea. It's not like I have a what light, kind of Mr. Seymour. Yeah. No way I'll ever forgive him for killing Lord Jisco and for trying to do us all in two. You know. But still, the bunch of us going against Yevon? No way. But still, Whoa. we have transgressed. <laughs> and Camera off, guys. We must go to Bevel. We must speak with Maester Micah and explain what has happened. There is no other way, I think. I agree. Uh. Sir Oren? So it is decided. Will you come with us? I am the troublemaker, after all. Yeah, that's right. You can always count on Oren to complicate things. Yeah! Kamari roars and Oren runs off, and... I never asked you to follow me. Hey, but that's what friends are for. Right? Yep. Thank you. Huh? Friends, huh? Hmm. <laughs> Man, how can you all act like nothing's wrong? Must got nerves of steel or something. You're too edgy. Listen to the hymn and calm down. All right. Let's save. Well, there's no reason to save right now. Let's see what we can do with the sphere grid. Doesn't look like much, but we'll try something. Cool. We're good there. Okay, finally I can do some things with Oron. There's just so many blank places in his sphere grid. Like, there's so many blank places. So... Let's move on. Lulu, what she got? There, I want to cast this really quick. 
Yep, give me bio. I have no idea what it is or what it does, but I'm gonna take it. <laughs> Alright, Waka. Okay. That's everybody for right now. Good. Is that coming from the temple? Yes, it is Yevon's gift. It soothes the hearts of the faithful. Say, you feel something weird in the air. It's the fairies, I think. Some kind of bad vibes or something. I thought so. Who is that singing? The Faith. Oh. Huh? The Faith? What? It can sing? Of course it can. Don't be a fool. Say, isn't the ground shaking? This doesn't sound very good. <laughs> I'm sure that Maester Micah will listen to us. This doesn't sound good. It sounds like there's foreboding going this on here. This smell different now. Jamari not know if this good or bad. Dungeon, seriously, Dungeon Design 101 here. What is it? Serious, okay, here we go. Uh, dungeon Design. Most dungeons will, uh, this is called Dungeon Design 201. It's cliche number 84 in RPGs. Most dungeons will include hidden passages which are nearly impossible to see from a bird's eye view, yet would be blaringly obvious from the party's perspective. This is also known as the interior decorators anticipated your out-of-body experience cliche. Uh, one other thing I wanted to say really quick, I missed out on this one, but I think that after the last couple of areas it's, it's relevant. Um, cliche number 79, which is known as the Xenobiology Rule. And uh, basically it says that the predatory species of the world will include representatives of all of the following. Giant spiders, giant scorpions, giant snakes, giant beetles, wolves, squid, fish that float in midair, gargoyles, golems, carnivorous plants, chimeras, griffins, cockatrices, hydras, minotaurs, burrowing things with big claws, things that can paralyze you, things that can put you to sleep, things that can petrify you, at least 20 different creatures with poisonous tentacles, and dragons, always dragons. I think we found most of them at this point, so I thought it'd be a, a relevant to say the, to say the list. All right, let's go talk to Oran. Jack used to sing this song. This is Jack's song. Yeah, over and over. <laughs> but not this good, that's for sure. Another trait you share. The, what? You were listening? Oh, flashback. Hmm. 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 I thought he'd be the kind of guy that would hang out at Margaritaville. Your singing reminded me of Spira. Mm -hmm. All right, you're not originally from Xanarkin, are you? You homesick? Maybe. Say, Titus is home, sir. Get to Xanarkin anyway. Sin? Uh huh. I thought so. That proved it. Sin was the link between Xanarkin and Spira. Which means, if we kill Sin, I'll never be able to go home. You know, I kind of, like I said, I kind of appreciate what they're trying to do with Titus, where they're trying to tell a story about a character that basically is a man out of time, a Rip Van Winkle, if you will. The singing stopped. Uh, I have to find another boss. The ground. Oh, Sin. There he is. Hi, Sin. Sin! The toxin, watch out! It was then I knew that Sin 
really was my old man. For the first time, I was finally able to believe it. The song you were listening to. What is it this time? So he was attracted to the song. Xanarkind. Ah, you homesick too? I want one of those so bad. I want my own blitz ball. That's not your world anymore. Your sin now. Hey, I'm older now, you know? I know. Kajar's hero, right here. You want this to end. I'll find a way, promise. Now I'm in the desert. Yep. Okay, I have to point out a cliche here really quick, guys. But first I gotta get up on the... Uh, where am I? He is the hero. He wants Titus to I end the British in once and for all. Be good for a while, okay? There we go. Four remedies. Okay, we're good now. Okay, I want to point out one more cliche as I'm saving. Uh, cliche number 182, compression of time. As you approach the final confrontation with the villain, events will become increasingly awkward, contrived, and disconnected from, the uh, from each other. Almost as if some cosmic author was running up against a deadline and had to slap together the ending at a last minute. There's a lot of controversy over the fact that we just went from uh, the uh, like a like a like a blizzardy section and now here we are on a in a desert. It's kind of a and I'm all by myself here. This is great. Phew. I don't think I can fight this thing. I can't flee. Need some help? Yes. Lulu.
got some of it. I screwed up because I always I I, I seem to be uh, confusing the uh, the square and the, uh, the 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 triangle button. All right, I'm gonna heal myself really quick. Casting haste. Oh, he's blind. That's what's going on. You got any eye drops? I think I do. I didn't see he had darkness. Down now. That did it. Yeah, I got some of my party back. others? <sighs> Haven't found them yet. We're supposed to stay in one place if we get split up. Wait here if you want. He's not. Thank you, uh, Angel, uh, thank you, like, uh, thank you, Angel, uh, I saw your retweet, thank you. Okay, I am going back and I'm saving again. I guess I can't play Blitzball out in the desert. That kind of stinks. Coming up to where I think some of the Albed sigils are. Oh. Waka. Waka! Mm. You alone? Mm hmm. Where's Yuna? I can't haste Oron. Damn it! First I lose Yuna, then I'm ambushed by Machina. Great day I'm having. Okay. Albed first aid kits. First aid kit placed by the Albed. Oh boy, I've walked into Dune. I've walked into Dune, haven't I? Frank Herbert somewhere is laughing at me. Oh, I forgot this thing's immune to magic. Farewell. That's how it's done. Sorry, I did not want to use that black magic spear. <laughs> it's 
Okay. I see. I gotta go get Kamari. Use the black magic spirits for Lulu. She benefits from it more. That makes sense. Okay, that was me being stupid. I shouldn't have done that. That is the first time I've ever seen him miss. I have never seen him miss. Oh, I see what happened. They inflicted darkness on him. He's got a few more eye drops left. There we go. Yeah, <laughs> power to the teddy bear. I actually want to get my girlfriend one of those, actually. Yeah, I'm serious. I actually do want to get her one of those. I hear Square Enix store sells them, or they did, though they might have sold out. Alright, let's go this way. Yeah, I figured he wasn't going to be able to hit it. Right now, we're grinding, we're grinding, we're grinding. Moving on, we're grinding. Is that Kamari over there? Well, walk is a bit hurt. Farewell. Yeah, there goes the. Dra There's some dragons so. right there. I found the Conlands is a good place to grind before you go into the mountains. Okay. And maybe I'm in the wrong place. Here's Kamari. Yep, 
He was trying to climb. Let's dig our way out. Well, we dug ourselves into this hole. It's not your fault, Kamari. We dug ourselves in this hole. How do we get out of this hole? Let's dig ourselves out of this hole. <laughs> brilliant, Homer Simpson. That is absolutely brilliant. Okay, there's no other way around here. Oh, oh great. Another preemptive strike. Oh, no. I get the preemptive strike this time. That's good. Enough. At least the characters are a little bit more balanced here. Back to Titus. Spear. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. We're moving, we're moving. And Horon. And we're moving, we're moving. Is there something in here? No, there's not. It's like I'm on Tatooine. I feel like I'm having episode seven beginning flashbacks. Anybody else having episode seven flashbacks? If they if they call me uh, FN2187, I'm gonna have uh, some serious things. Keep your fastest players on the field so you get to go first, okay. Well, right now, Titus is pretty fast. I don't know how fast he is. I'll pull out Kamari right now. No, Kamari's not very fast right now. Take that. All right, let's see if I can move Kamari on the grid. I can! But I can only move him a little bit. <laughs> I can only move him a little bit. It's not that tough for me to teach him white ma white magic. Looks like I could break into one of Unispheres or something like that over here. And I can also teach the Ultima spell. I don't have any level fours just yet. Okay. Oh, I didn't use it. Wait, hold on. You know what? I'm going to go down here first and then I'll go back up. Okay, moving back up. Let's go find Riku. Hopefully after I find her, there'll be a save point. Enough. 
then we will defy Yevon if we must. That's how it's done. Yes. Okay. Sorry about the grind, everybody. Oh! Hey, guys! Where's Uni? Gone. Gone. Some guardian I am. Um... There's something I want to tell you, but promise not to say anything? Hmm? No glaring, either. I know where we are. We're on Bicanel Island. There's a place us Albed call home near here. Uni's there, I'm sure of it. Other Albed must have come and rescued her. Rescued? You mean kidnapped? What does it matter as long as she's safe? That's right. Anyway, I will take you there if you promise that you won't tell anyone about it. Especially not Yevonites, okay? You know they don't like us all bad. Who knows what they'll do if they knew? Give me a break. What are you accusing Yevon of this time? Yevon did something really bad to us before. Well, you all bad must have deserved it. Whoa! Ugh. Can't you guys talk about this later? Just yes, I kind of do. About this I kind of do, but promise? I could use some help finding them because there's like Come three on. in the next area. And there's like two at home. All right, I promise. Lead the way. So the next major, two major areas, if home is after the desert, the desert and home are the two major areas left. So. Okay. It's almost 1 a.m. Uh, for Tony. Okay. No, no, Tony, that's okay, Tony. What are you thinking, Kajar? Um, Tony, don't, no, it's okay, Tony. Um, we're probably going to be looking for some outbed primers. Kajar, you want to stay up? I'll stay. I'll keep running if you're going to keep, if you're going to stay with me. But if you got to go, that's okay. We'll just cut the stream and we'll resume it tomorrow or, or Wednesday. Uh, depending upon if my, it, depending upon if I'm buried under two feet of snow tomorrow, I may not be able to stream, but I'm sure going to try. Uh, so take care, Tony. Kajar, you want to stay in? Are you still in? We're going to be looking for these, uh, We'll look for the outbed primers if you're still in. That way. Uh, let me handle the machina. I can take them apart piece by piece. Really? Wow, that's really nice. Well, thank you. Okay, you steal.
What the heck is that? What the heck is that? Immune to slow. <laughs> and I don't have Yuna with me. This will be fun. Oh, oh. You've got to be kidding me. You have got to be kidding me. Can I just flee? My turn now. I won't go so easy on you next time. Okay. Yeah, it wasn't immune to darkness. I'm sure it wasn't immune to darkness. <laughs> It also had about 3 billion XP, uh, HP. Okay, I'm going for the first Albed Sigil. I think I see it up in the distance. Oh yeah. Yes, it is a slight exaggeration, yes. Oh, somebody got darkness, he got darkness cast on him all of a sudden. I didn't see that. Do I have any more eye drops? I got one set of eye drops left. Well, you can have them. And they cast darkness on him. Seriously, that's so cheap. Yes, that's 45. 45,000 is not 3 billion. Well, I don't know about that. It feels like 3 billion. <laughs>
Okay, we're good here. Let's do Lulu. Okay, here we are. Okay, we're good now. Four high potions, good. I think I see the outfit of... And there's the worm again. Alright, darkness does seem to work. Alright, we're still here. Dark attack. You know, for, for having darkness inflicted on it, armor break or power break? I think I have armor break. I do have power break and armor break. Your pain shall be twofold. Alright, let me give her some healing potion right now. I miss. Well, that's something. Power break. The darkness does seem to be helping. Thank you for that tip. Okay, skill. What just happened there? I hope I'm not hurting him. What do I do to get him back? I think he spit out Waka. Oh my god, Waka's alive. I'll take it. This is only one of these things, right? There's like only one of these things that I'm gonna get handed, correct?
Only one per battle. Yeah, well, great. <laughs> so that means I'm going to be handing quite a few of these. Is that what you're saying? Because that's just going to be fantastico, right? <laughs> just fantastico. I think the blizzard attack seems to do the most damage. Okay, we got this. Earthquake, is this it? Is that the end? No, it's not the end. It hurt, but it's not the end. Titus is gonna do except run away. Riku is gonna just steal and, and get probably crushed. Now right now I need to I need to keep I need to keep darkness on this one, so. Okay, it missed. Did I get it? Don't worry, I'm sure they'll cat I'm sure they'll give me just one more in a few minutes. Oh, it ran away. No fight. It just ran away. No, it wasn't hard. Alright, there's the Albed Primer, the next one. I don't want to go there just yet. I think this is a save point over here. Alright, I'll put, I'll put Titus back, okay? Gotcha there, there's covered. Titus. Do you already have the primer for Q? I don't think so. I'm gonna go for that one right now. Farewell. I know there's at least three in the desert that I have that's to get. That's how it's done. And um, I just got one of them, so that's good. Beware a fiend. useful.
Okay, I increased my agility, that's good. What about Lulu? Okay, increase her HP. I thought for sure there was going to be another worm there. I really did. They're my three fastest guys. Why did they get the Why did they get the ambush? All right, I'll heal Waka in the next turn once I'm done here. Farewell. No time to waste. Let's go. Okay, now you tell me this. Oh, I didn't get the Albed Primer for the last one. One for Q. Should be over here somewhere. Uh, Bail? I won't go so easy on you next time. There's Q. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, I'm just trying to get the primers right now. Let's... This is supposed to be a happy time. Let's not argue about who ran from who, screaming and crying. <laughs> Okay, I'm just going to look up where the next primer is. Okay, so that was, yeah, that was primer Q. And I think, and I already got primer R, so we're good there. So the only ones left, I would say, would be, you know, S. Where, where's primer S? And I, I don't know if it's in the desert. I think it's in the desert, but I can't remember exactly where in the desert it is. So I'm just looking up the information right now. I think we're good though. I, I, I mean, I think we got everything up to this point, at least that we can get before we hit home. Home is gonna be where a lot of the primers are and I don't know if I'll be able to get all of them. Okay. Okay, I have been told. Yeah, S is at home. Okay. Where's the early bird when you need it? I will go so easy on you next time. Well, I got level two. wants me to fight this thing. You know what? Fine. Fine, I'll fight it. You want me to fight it? Fine. Darkness and sleep.
Let's end this. I think I can play to sleep. Right, darkness seems to help. Okay, I'll do that with Riku. Leave it to me. Lazara seems to do the most damage to this thing. Oh, it grabbed Lula. Great. I was trying to inflict darkness on this thing. there. Uh, I guess it didn't like Lulu. The taste of Black Mage is not exactly very appetizing. I think Lulu's okay, though. Well, I still saw, uh, armor. Hold on. Okay, there's no more armor. I don't think there's any more armor. Oh, I finally put it to sleep. <sighs> it's out. Everyone, go, go, go. Oh, poison. I think it's immune to poison. Earthquake. That hurt, but it wasn't fatal. Armor break, scan, power break, armor break, scan. Okay, it's not got darkness anymore. The darkness must have worn off.
Nighty night. No, sleep didn't work. It keeps eating Lulu. <laughs> Like, if at first you don't succeed, try, try again, I guess. Darkness still doesn't work. Farewell. Hopefully that didn't kill Lulu, it was still... Don't kill it! Oh, figures. That just figures. by Riku equals three sphere moves. Hmm. How can a bird grow so big? Live and let live. What about those, uh, Sarlacc pits? Are those supposed to be like that? Are they not real traps? Or they're, they are traps? Or what?
Okay. Waka. Okay. Bring Riku back. Steel. We're moving Riku. One second, guys. Stop calling me. I won't. Not now. I can't. Okay. So, can I go into these traps or no? They'll just hit, kill me instantly? Steel? There's actually, a, uh, there's actually a trophy for getting like 200 steals with her, so... Farewell. No time to waste. Let's go. Oh, I can't go any further, okay. You sure this is the way? Yeah! I think. Do you think I can take those things on? Doing pretty well with Riku. Ok, 
Okay, power sphere, yes. Ability sphere, yes. Now she does spare change, good. Waka. Ability sphere. Silence buster now. Okay, good. Alright, we're moving. Yeah, that's a trick. I'm not going in there. trap. Oh, I have to go in there? here. curious why I'm not really doing much fighting right now because honestly I'm actually pretty bored right you know this is this is getting kind of boring I won't go so easy on you next time all this grunt this it's kind of is making me a little bored so okay I can't go that way because the sandstorm I'm not even getting much attention on them. You need to follow the red... Okay, then I'll follow... Okay, but what about that huge pit? Look like a trap. This is the way I came in. I wanted to go around the other way.
I'm going the wrong way. Okay. Well, I did want to see what... There was one other area I wanted to investigate a little bit. If I can actually get there. Don't you run, Needles! There was a lip over here or something I wanted to investigate. Oh, there it is. The treasure chest. Enough. Yeah! This is what Maniac wants. Okay, all that for a freaking elixir. Well, elixir's not too bad. And one of these again. Nope, we're leaving. We're leaving. Live and let live! Exactly. <laughs> Praise be to heaven! <laughs> want right now is that save point. There we go. Walker. No, Walker's okay. Walker's okay now. I don't have any level three. Let me hold off until I have a level three before I do anything crazy with him. What about Titus? Okay, the same sphere healed him. That's what I thought. Okay. And I got one for Riku. Cool. 
So this won't take that long. Oh yeah. Enough. Since no we've got to, to this portion of the game yet, and where it's all this stuff happening and all these random stuff, then I think we've come up against a cliche. Hold on. Okay. Cliche number 74. If you meet the Buddha in a random encounter, kill him. When you're out wandering around the world, you must kill everything you meet. People, animals, plants, insects, fire hydrants, small cottages, anything and everything is just plain out to get you. And maybe because of your rampant kleptomania. <laughs> See Garrett's principle. So. Okay. Well, I'll try to I'll try to level up the other guys then. I'll try to grind the other guys. Alright, this is the way I wanted to go. That hurt. Live and let live. I'm just running from everything right now. Live. Okay, there's nothing over here. And another sandworm, seriously. I won't go so easy on you next time. Now, I did so much grinding in the earlier portion of the game. In case you're curious what I'm doing right now, I'm trying to find treasure chests and stuff. I'll be right back. Okay. Oh, this is where I just was. You know what? Screw it. I'm going to kill this thing. I'm tired of it. The fact that this thing continues to exist is just an annoyance. Chill. There's no rush. I did, I put darkness on it. I guess the dark...
It's still got darkness on it. Alright, it's immune to sleep. We took out the bird. Alright, looks like we gotta fall into the trap. Which, if this is true, if I have to fall into this trap, then I'm reading another cliche. Not fighting this thing again. Live and let live. I guess I gotta go into the pit. It's immune to darkness. Immune to silence. Try, let me try white magic and see what happens on a scan. What can a scan tell me about this thing? But it may cause confusion. It absorbs water. Immunities to silence, darkness, slow, zombie, power break. Alright. That did armor break. Try this. Remedies. Let me check another remedy. Uh. 
At least that, I guess the confusion broke finally. Okay. And we just hit another. Okay, hold on. We just hit another cliche. Hold on. I didn't know if this one was going to be in the game, but it is. So we're going to get to this cliche really quick. Hold on. Um, I think it's called the Law of Traps. I can find it. I just saw it here. I got it's like a law of traps. Hold on. Now where are you? All the travel dungeon designs. There you go, there they are, Law of Numbers, Laws of Travel, Friendly Fire. Here it is, cliche number 106, the Law of Traps. No matter how obvious the trap, you can't complete the game unless you fall into it. And that's what we just did. Just a bit. I think, are we coming close to home? Are we near home? Make it? Is that sick? Oh boy. You weak you friends? Well, just don't stand there. Come on! Let's go kick those guano out of our home! Who? Sid, leader of the Albed. He's my dad. Oh, there's your Let's Sid. Go. Yeah, we have to save Uni. 
Not only Yuna, right? Right. And there's Albed Primer number 19. I now know how to say S. Okay. Key items. I'm getting there. I'm learning how to speak Albed. It's number 14, number... Sorry, number 18, number 19. What's number 20? Hold on, I want to see what number 20 is. I'm looking to see where the next one is, hold on. So, number 21, I'm gonna go for number 21 before I go for number 20. These guys are all dead. Oh, they're letting me loot their bodies? Oh boy. Kajar, I think this is a good time to stop. I think this is a good place to stop. I found a save point. We're at home. We made it through the desert. I'm going on almost four hours stream. I'm going to have to cut this in half, probably. Uh, but, Kajar, I really appreciate all the help. I hope I wasn't too boring or anything like that while I was trying to... Uh, I, I, tr I, I, I beat those bosses. I beat those big guys, the sandworm and the big bird. I beat them only with your help. I never would have gotten through those areas without your help, so I appreciate it tremendously. Um, thanks to all my new subscribers that have come in today. I really appreciate it. Thank you for retweeting me, uh, Angel. Uh, really appreciate it, but I think we're going on four hours right now, and I've got some things I gotta I gotta do. I gotta I gotta make some preparations for the storm tonight. So I don't know. I'm probably gonna be buried under two feet of snow tomorrow. I don't know what's happening just yet, but we'll see. Until next time, guys. My name is Maniac with Game Access on Ed. Kajar, take care, everyone. Over and out. <laughs>